Hey there, military buffs and gadget geeks. Today we're diving into the world of advanced military tech. The Hunter Armored Fighting Vehicle, AFV, represents a significant technological leap for the Singapore Army, as it is their first fully digitized platform integrated with advanced C4, command, control, communications, and computer systems. Developed to meet the evolving challenges of modern warfare, the Hunter AFV combines cutting-edge technology, enhanced situational awareness, and improved command capabilities to enhance the Army's operational effectiveness. The vehicle's crew can rapidly transmit and receive critical information, including intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance, ISR data, mission updates and tactical orders, ensuring a synchronized and coordinated response. The JAS-39 Gripen is a lightweight single-engine multi-role fighter aircraft developed by the Swedish aerospace company Saab. One of the key features of the Gripen is its flexibility and ease of maintenance, which allows it to operate from short and unpaved runways. It also has a high level of operational readiness, with a quick turnaround time between missions. The Gripen has been widely praised for its cost-effectiveness and performance, making it a popular choice among countries with smaller defense budgets. The Milrem Themis UGV, Unmanned Ground Vehicle, is an advanced robotic platform developed by Milrem Robotics, an Estonian defense technology company. The Themis UGV features a modular and adaptable design that allows for various mission-specific configurations and payloads. Its rugged and durable construction ensures reliable performance in challenging terrains and harsh environments. The vehicle's tracked chassis provides excellent mobility and stability, allowing it to traverse difficult terrain and navigate obstacles with ease. The MQ-20 Predator Sea Avenger is an advanced unmanned aerial vehicle developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the United States Air Force. It is an upgraded version of the MQ-9 Reaper drone and is designed to operate in high-risk environments and conduct a range of missions. One of the key features of the MQ-20 Predator Sea Avenger is its stealth capabilities. It is designed to be low observable meaning that it can operate in contested airspace without being detected by enemy radar systems. The Rosamac is an 8x8 armored personnel carrier, APC, designed and manufactured by the Polish defense company, Rosamac SA. The vehicle is based on the Finnish Patria AMV, Armored Modular Vehicle Platform, and was developed to meet the requirements of the Polish Armed Forces. One of the key features of the Rosomac APC is its mobility. It has a top speed of up to 100 km per hour and can travel up to 700 km on a single tank of fuel. It is also amphibious, allowing it to cross water obstacles without preparation. The Ripsaw M5 showcases a sleek and futuristic appearance, characterized by its low-profile angular design and aggressive stance. It features a rugged steel construction, built to withstand demanding terrains and harsh environments. The vehicle's compact size and high power-to-weight ratio contribute to its exceptional maneuverability and agility on both off-road and urban landscapes. In unmanned mode, it can be remotely controlled, allowing for safe and effective reconnaissance, surveillance, and target acquisition. In manned mode, the vehicle provides a protected and ergonomic cabin for operators, equipped with advanced controls and situational awareness systems. Caesar, camion équipe d'un système d'artillerie, is a French-made 155mm self-propelled howitzer developed by Nexter Systems. The system is based on a wheeled truck chassis and is designed to provide highly mobile and responsive fire support to ground troops. 
The howitzer is equipped with an advanced fire control system that includes a laser range finder, a digital battlefield management system, and a navigation system. The system has earned a reputation as one of the most effective and reliable self-propelled howitzers in the world and is highly regarded for its accuracy, mobility, and versatility. The Rheinmetall Fuchs Evolution is a highly advanced armored personnel carrier, APC, developed by Rheinmetall Defense. Building upon the success and capabilities of the original Fuchs APC, the Fuchs Evolution represents a significant upgrade with enhanced features, improved performance, and modernized technologies. One of the key upgrades in the Fuchs Evolution is its enhanced mobility. The vehicle is equipped with a powerful engine, providing increased power and improved maneuverability. The advanced suspension system and high-performance drivetrain enable the Fuchs Evolution to traverse diverse terrains, including rough terrain and off-road conditions. The Autocar Cobra is a highly versatile and widely used armored vehicle developed by Autocar, a leading Turkish defense company. The Cobra armored vehicle features a 4x4 configuration, providing it with enhanced maneuverability and off-road capability. Its design incorporates a monocoque steel hull, which offers protection against ballistic threats, mines, and improvised explosive devices IEDs, ensuring the safety of the occupants in combat and high-threat environments. The Arian Smet UGV Unmanned Ground Vehicle is a cutting-edge autonomous robotic platform developed by French defense company Nexter Robotics. The Arian Smet UGV is a compact and highly maneuverable robotic system. It is equipped with tracks for enhanced mobility, allowing it to traverse challenging terrains, including rough and uneven surfaces. The vehicle's compact size and agility enable it to operate in urban environments, narrow spaces, and confined areas where larger vehicles may have difficulty accessing. The Aksungur is an unmanned aerial vehicle produced by Turkish Aerospace Industries. It is a medium-altitude, long-endurance drone that is designed for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as for conducting armed operations. The Aksungur is equipped with various sensors and cameras that provide it with real-time intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. It also has a payload capacity of up to 750 kilograms, which allows it to carry various weapons and ammunition, including air-to-surface missiles and guided bombs. The CV-90 Infantry Fighting Vehicle is a modern and highly capable tracked armored vehicle designed and manufactured by BAE Systems Haglunds, a Swedish defense company. It is specifically designed to transport infantry troops into the battlefield while providing them with superior protection, firepower, and mobility. Its primary role is to transport infantry squads and support their operations with integrated firepower and situational awareness. The vehicle's spacious and well-designed compartment can accommodate a fully equipped infantry squad, providing them with a protected and comfortable environment during operations. The Eurofighter Typhoon is a twin-engine, multi-role fighter aircraft developed by a consortium of European countries including the United Kingdom, Germany, Italy, and Spain. It was designed to be a highly maneuverable and agile aircraft capable of carrying out a wide range of missions, including air-to-air -air combat, air-to-ground attack, and reconnaissance. The Typhoon is highly maneuverable and agile, making it a formidable opponent in air-to-air -air combat. It is also capable of carrying out ground attack missions, including close air support, interdiction, and deep strike missions. The Patria Nemo Container is an innovative and versatile containerized mortar system developed by Patria, a Finnish defense company. 
It provides a highly adaptable and mobile indirect fire support capability to military forces operating in various environments. The containerized design allows for seamless integration with a wide range of military vehicles, including trucks, amphibious vehicles, and naval vessels. The modular nature of the system enables it to be easily installed and removed from different platforms, providing flexibility and adaptability. The T-129 ATAK is a Turkish attack helicopter designed and manufactured by Turkish Aerospace Industries TAI. The helicopter is based on the Italian Augusta Westland AW-129 helicopter, but with several key modifications and upgrades to meet the specific needs of the Turkish military. It is a twin-engine helicopter with a four-bladed rotor system and a sleek aerodynamic design. It is equipped with advanced avionics and weapons systems, including a helmet-mounted display system, a forward-looking infrared sensor, a laser rangefinder and designator, and a variety of air-to-ground missiles and rockets. The vehicle Bland de Combat d'Infanterie VBCI, is a French 8x8-wheeled infantry fighting vehicle IFV, developed by the French defense company Nexter Systems, formerly known as Giot Industries and Renault Trucks Defense. The VBCI is in service with the French Army and other countries, including Saudi Arabia, Qatar, and Cyprus. The VBCI is equipped with advanced technology and digital systems, including a battlefield management system, digital map display, and a satellite navigation system. The VBCI has seen combat in several conflicts, including the French intervention in Mali, where it demonstrated its effectiveness in counterinsurgency operations. The XQ-58A Valkyrie is a multi-role drone that comes in two versions, Block 1 and Block 2. Thanks to the open architecture, sensors and other systems can be quickly integrated into the drone. One of the advantages of a UAV is that it does not require a runway for takeoff. It is launched using a special launcher and Valkyrie lands on the ground with the help of a parachute. The Valkyrie is currently in service only with the U.S. Air Force. The UAV will likely be used to penetrate enemy air defenses and operate with a high degree of autonomy, potentially as part of a drone swarm. The German Gepard is a self-propelled anti-aircraft gun system, specifically designed to provide effective air defense capabilities for military forces. Known for its agility and firepower, the Gepard is one of the most prominent and widely recognized anti-aircraft systems in the world. Its powerful engine allows for rapid deployment and maneuverability on various terrains, making it suitable for both defensive and offensive operations. The Gepard's mobility is a crucial factor in ensuring its ability to respond quickly to airborne threats. The Buffalo is a military mine-resistant armored vehicle designed specifically for mine clearing and explosive ordnance disposal EOD, operations. The Buffalo has been extensively used by the United States military and other armed forces around the world. It has played a vital role in various conflict zones, including Iraq and Afghanistan, where landmines and IEDs have posed significant threats. The Buffalo's capability to clear explosive hazards and create safer routes has been instrumental in enabling military operations, facilitating infrastructure development, and protecting civilian populations. The AN-TWQ-1 Avenger is a highly capable short-range air defense system used by the United States military and several other countries. The Avenger system consists of a turret mounted on a Humvee, high-mobility multi-purpose wheeled vehicle, or similar platform. The turret is equipped with eight ready-to-fire FIM-92 Stinger surface-to-air missiles, which are capable of engaging targets at ranges of up to 8 kilometers. 
These missiles are guided by infrared homing seekers, enabling them to track and intercept airborne threats with high precision. The M113 Armored Personnel Carrier, APC, is a versatile and widely used military vehicle designed for troop transport and battlefield mobility. It has been in service with various armed forces around the world since its introduction in the 1960s. The M113 has proven itself as a reliable and adaptable platform, with numerous variants developed to fulfill a range of mission requirements. The vehicle can accommodate a driver and a crew of up to 11 fully equipped soldiers, including a commander and a gunner. Thank you for watching our video on the latest military technology. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and leave a comment with your thoughts below.